guys welcome back to my weekly meal planning so this week Dustin and I are eating a little bit healthier so the meal planning and the shopping is a little bit different since I couldn't find as many good deals at Publix with the meals that we have chosen um, I strictly shopped at Walmart this time so I will have to show you my haul when I get back but for now here is my um, weekly meal plan Monday we are having a crock pot chicken fajitas with Mexican rice. Tuesday grilled chicken bruschetta with green beans. Spinach and feta stuffed chicken peas and salad for Wednesday. Thursday is a quick skillet steak and veggies with rice. Friday is pork chops with mushrooms and green beans. Saturday we will go out to eat like every single week. And then Sunday is a leftovers day or a free-for-all day, whichever it turns out to be. If we have leftovers, it'll be a leftovers day. If not, free-for-all. This is my shopping list. It's kind of tentative. Um, like the veggies may be frozen or fresh. And same with the fruits. I'm trying to stay away from canned vegetables. And um, yeah, that is the shopping list for this week. So I'll show you my haul when I get back from shopping and I'll tell you how much I spent. Alright guys, so I just got back from my shopping trip from Walmart and I have my haul in front of me. Like I said, I only went to Walmart this week because Publix didn't have as many good deals and we kind of went with a different meal plan than normal. So we're trying to eat a little bit healthier because we're starting to try to conceive again. like hardcore try to conceive you know we haven't been preventing this whole time but now we're trying to you know eat healthier and prepare our bodies for the miracle of life. This is the haul this week as you can see there's mainly fruits and veggies so I'll start on this end like I do normally we got garlic um, I hate mincing garlic and it is so much more easier to just eat it out of this and it's only like a dollar fifty so Garlic, feta cheese, and mozzarella cheese with the part skim, and mushrooms. Like I said last week, they are the uncut ones because it's a little bit cheaper to buy them uncut. Balsamic vinegar, a watermelon, um, tortillas, bananas, apples for Dustin's lunches, white onions, or... Vidalia onions is what it was, not white Vidalia. Red onions, tomatoes, spinach, um, some pork chops. These are not for this week. These are actually for next week. No, these are for this week. These are for this week. And I got them on a really good sale. So that's why I went ahead and got these kind. And I'm really happy because these are the all natural kind. And I've had these before and they taste amazing. Um, of course, we got some chicken breasts. We got four and a half pounds almost. Four and a quarter pounds. Some um, steak. Uh, popcorn chicken and fries for the little ones. Milk. Um, some almond milk unsweetened. It only has 30 calories. This is for my smoothies in the morning. Uh, mango chunks and pineapple chunks. These are also for my smoothies. Three pepper onion blend. So this has the red pepper, the yellow pepper, and the green pepper and onion in it all chopped up already. Even though I normally say just buy the regular um, item and then chop it up yourself. And it costs less, but in this case it does not because one red onion one yellow onion and one orange onion each cost a dollar seventy seven each so it's a lot cheaper to just buy this and this was a dollar eighty i think so a lot better and it's a big pack i need it for one recipe and i'll have enough left over for maybe one or two more recipes um a thing of chopped spinach it is already frozen so that's a good thing so i can keep this the spinach over here is for my smoothies this is for cooking I got a thing of green beans and some wheat bread and that is it for this week um i spent about i think it was 59 dollars for everything total which is actually pretty good considering what i got um and yeah 
Thanks guys for watching this week's uh, grocery haul and menu planning. Come back next week for my next week's haul. Bye guys.